Good morning. Good morning to the ring of power. Sun is rising. We don't see it here because there are clouds, but we feel the energy of the rising sun. And I was sitting here this morning in meditation close to Tamara. And with joy, I could really say my inner GPS from the last week did work. And I really could find this kind of humor which connects me with my surrounding and with the community around me. And always staying focused on the question, what is truth about? And for this week, it came again to me, this sentence, I decided to, to choose for every week uh, archetypic power for one week and also a power sentence which will guide me. And for this week I did choose the Fool. And the power sentence of the Fool is I am really connected with joy to truth. With humor and courage I break through all the conventions in the service of justice and freedom. And the Fool is gifting us with the quality not to obey to points where we know this obey is not connected to the truth. And so it's also inviting us to leave the old conventional identification behind us and really to search for our cosmic identification and to find an unusual path and a path of humor to speak the truth even there where it's not comfortable. And so this will guide me and maybe also you in this coming week. And I can say I was really nourished in this week also from the experience to build quite a strong field of community with people who I never met before. Some I met before, but many I did not meet before. And we created this kind of field where we are really interested in the truth and where we are Sudden, suddenly noticing that every identification with an individual me is connected to a higher self which connects us with compassion to truth and to trust and to life. And in this sense uh, I feel it's very much about learning this kind of community which can embrace many differences because we find together the higher order of life which is guiding us. In the last week I uh, was driving close to Tamara in a little village with the GPS and uh, it was wrong and it was guiding me through many many little roads I had to turn and uh, find the way and the GPS did guide me wrong. And so this I take as a symbol because this mon morning I was awake, awakening with the sentence which kind of intelligence do you follow? And in the German language, we speak of the KI, of the artificial intelligence, or the cosmic intelligence. And this is the question. We know that this kind of KI is an interesting development of our technical, yeah, that we are able to develop those kind of precision is really amazing that human beings are able to, but which kind of ethic is this KI following? Do we find the higher ethic in life? And the KI is um, bringing a lot of confusion. We don't know anymore what is really the truth. And we can discover that an opinion is not the same like the connection to a higher truth, which is beyond all our opinions. And this is coming from the cosmic intelligence. And so it's very helpful to feel the embracement of the stillness of life, even in all the movements we are in. So that the picture that the, the empty sky is embracing all of us, and we are conducted from this higher intelligence, if we allow. So driving through this little village, I was still oriented in this emptiness and in this kind of humor that I knew <coughs> if I stay calm now and not go to the identifi identification of feeling lost, 
I will be guided out of this labyrinth. Yes, and this I take as a symbol for us as this week. And I wish all of us a blessed week. A lot of birds are around me here. I take this as a symbol for the intelligence of a collective higher me, which is guided from trust from the cosmic being. And KI, in the last week it happened that uh, my website did not work, so all the ones who wanted to participate in the seminar could not find the entrance. So I hope it's working now again. It was break, it all was uh, confused. We did not find the way to, to really correct it. I hope now it's working again. And you are warmly welcomed for a donation to participate in a webinar where we ca can build the field of us, of we in the ring of power, even that we are sitting at many different places. So we will be in this webinar with the question, what does it mean to have a spiritual practice in our life and how can we stay in the community wisdom with connected with the higher self? So warm welcome and I wish all of us a blessed week. See you again next Monday. And if you have any question, write to our contact address to the office of Sabine Lichtenfels. Warm greetings. Have a blessed week. Yasin. Ja,